Also, don't ask if anything is for sale or for trade because it's not. I'm going to start with the Huskies first, starting with the Laying Down Uni Toys plush, a.k.a. Carl Dick plush. I think this one actually says Uni Toys this time, but it's the same company, I was told. But I want to make this clear to you. This was bought off Amazon. I named him Rip here. I think that's how the name is said. If you guys heard of the Black Blood Alliance series, it's a comic book series. I think they're all wolves, if I'm not mistaken. You'd have to go check it out yourself. Uh, but yeah, this was bought off Amazon, I think, for $30, $30 I think it was. I could be wrong. It might have been more because of the shipping. I don't think they're making this plush anymore, sadly. I don't know why, but is it just me? Or is it every time a Siberian Husky plush that is black on the top, white on the bottom like this, always seems to, like, the company just stops making them so much, like... I think because people buy them a lot. Maybe you guys can let me know in the comment section down below and explain that to me. Because I don't know if it's just me or not. It just seems like the Huskies get sold that fast. I'm not sure if it's coming back, though. I I think, according to Sears, it's temporary out of stock. I could be wrong, though. I do hope it comes back because I really understand what it feels like to not have your dream plush. And I do hope you guys get it. I highly recommend it. It's a really nice plush. And, man... I don't know if you guys noticed this, the face looks angry. That's uh, definitely why I call this one Rapier, but I think Rapier is originally a girl, but mine is a boy. So you can say hi to Rapier. Hopefully you can see him clearly. But yeah, you can always look on Amazon and see if they bring this one back. The next one, the signature Siberian Husky, you guys, I don't think, have trouble finding them this much. I mean, if you did, it's probably because no one's selling them. This one was from eBay, but a friend gave me to this... Yeah, a friend gave me this one a long time ago. It's why she's really worn. I named her, I think I named her Cassandra. I think that's what I named her. I'm not 100% sure. So yeah, this one's a female. Her name's Cassandra. Uh, you could always try getting them off eBay. I, I try to. Some of you, you, you use Macari. I'm sorry if I stutter. I have that issue sometimes, but I know some of you can use Macari. But originally, I prefer eBay. I think because they're more strict on eBay. I think they're more strict because it's like when it comes to scamming, it seems like they take it more seriously. And that that is a lot more trustworthy, but not 100% because there's still scammers running around. But sorry for getting off topic. But yeah, this one's from eBay from a friend. Um, The... Other one, this one is Faithful Friends Siberian Husky. This one, I believe, was from Amazon. I don't think they're making this plush anymore, because I didn't see it anymore. Like I said before, it's always the Huskies. The black and white Huskies are always constantly being sold out. I hope they brought it back, though. I think they did, but wanted more money for it. 30-something dollars. I don't know if he's still being sold at Amazon anymore. I named him Steel, by the way. So yeah, I named him Steel from Balto. I guess you could try to look for him on Amazon. I don't know if he's there or not anymore. Hopefully he is for you guys. But yeah, that's where he came from. So a quick thing I wanted to say. I know they have a living nature version of the Siberian Huskies. And I just wanted to say real quick. I am sorry that I couldn't show you that one. Because sadly I don't have that one. But if you guys really want to know the difference between this signature Siberian Husky and the living nature Siberian Husky, uh, hopefully she doesn't mind me mentioning her name. Uh, her name is Timberkins94. Go check out her channel. I believe she did a good job of doing a comparison video between the signature Siberian Husky and the living nature Siberian Husky. I'll admit I wanted that one, and I was really this close to getting it. And I told my mom I wouldn't mind paying her the money for it. And she sadly refused. I think she kind of hates stuffed animals sometimes, but it was a shame I couldn't get it. Like I said before, it's always the black and white huskies. But yeah, check out Timberkins94. She has the video. You might have to scroll down to get to it. So yeah, hopefully... For my red foxes, the Uni Toys one was bought on Amazon. I'll try to give you a quick look. My stuffed animals are kind of squished. It's kind of small up here, you know, it's kind of tight. This one was from Amazon. I don't think they're making it anymore, sadly. You could try to look for it. The Red Fox plush. 
I think Carl Dick, aka Uni Toys, stopped making them. But yeah, that's where I got him from. I don't know if I had a name for him first. I actually don't have a name for him, but this one is a boy. I haven't thought of a name for him yet. I'm still trying to decide. If you have name suggestions, I guess you could try to let me know in the comment section down below. But yeah, that's where I got this one from. And the signature one, uh, this was actually my very first signature. I named, I finally gave her a name. Her name is Blood Spill from the Black Blood Alliance. I think because of the markings, you know how Black, um, not Black Blood, but Blood Spill always had long black markings, I think, because she was like a Black Blood or something, or she was just born that way. I think that's what she was. She was born that way. This one just reminds me of Blood Spill a lot, so I had to give this one the name of Blood Spill, although Blood Spill is a big wolf, but if you read the manga you'd probably get the hint but yeah this one's name is blood spill she was bought on amazon a very very long time ago my father actually bought it for me when i was just a little girl i think i was like 11 or 10 years old but yeah that's where she came from if you want her that badly i highly suggest maybe ebay or macari you know this one's not really hard to find you might have to pay max if you want it with a code without a code i don't think it's that hard to get this one i honestly haven't checked prices on this one lately but I do believe you can get this one very easily. As for the other red fox, he's not as red looking. This one, I think I already gave him a name. Ah, uh, I forgot, what did I name him? Um, he's also named after the Black Blood Alliance characters, if I can remember his name. was his, I think his name was Riptide. I think that was his name was Riptide. I think that's what I named him. This one was bought off eBay. He's still being made, actually, so you guys can still get him on eBay for this new and lovely condition. I don't want to stress it on you, but I'd say get him as soon as possible, because I don't know if it's just me or not, but a lot of things have been going out of stock lately. But yeah, this one is on eBay. I guess try to get him as soon as possible. I guess depending on how badly you want him, he's really worth